Ladies and gents, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna break down a word, a very, very powerful word, uncomfortable. And let me tell you, uncomfortable is there every single day in our lives. Every single day. We are so uncomfortable. But you have to somehow destroy that feeling. And you have to get over uncomfortable to be successful. Let me tell you a quick story about uncomfortable. I was 18 years old, get out of high school, and I was looking for a job. So, my mom knows someone at an Italian place, uh, restaurant. So, I took this chance to go and talk to her and maybe I can get a job. What she said, I need to talk to the boss. I need to talk to the boss. So I start to feel uncomfortable at that moment, intimidated, because <clears throat> let me tell you about the boss. Italian guy, cigar, nose, a little bit heavy set, driving an old Russian luxury car I believe it was the old dictators Brezhnev car the guy was day night morning cigar I'm like okay well I gotta make money I have to survive and I have to do this I, I, I have no choice. I have to do this. I have to get uncomfortable and talk to the guy. So I find out which day he's there. He's coming. So I went there. The most uncomfortable moment in my life. Let me tell you that. So nobody's helping me. Nobody's nothing I I have to do this I'm going there this guy is again cigar so I walked up to him I said hey Giuseppe this is who I am his name was Giuseppe and I said I am looking for a job I know Eva She's uh, my mom's friend, and she told me, you might need somebody. Whew, I was almost sweating at this moment. And as you can see, even my sleeves are up right now, because I am getting uncomfortable just to talking about this. Cigar. This is what he said. Okay, kid. He talked like that because the cigar probably already killed his vocal cords, so. Okay, kid. What can you do? He asked me. I said, well, um, um, I learn anything. I can learn anything. Whatever you uh, can use me, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with it. He says, Okay, kid. Tomorrow. Can you come tomorrow? I said, yeah, of course I can. Okay. Tomorrow. You know this other location? You come tomorrow, okay? That's how we talked. I said, okay. Boom. Done. <laughs> Out. 
Ooh, very, very uncomfortable situation. So just a little story. And for some of you it might not seem that this is uncomfortable, but for an 18 year old, let's just say 25 years ago, we only had a black and white TV. I didn't know anybody at that magnitude. For me, that was a very, very uncomfortable situation. So, the moral of the story is that you have to get uncomfortable in your life to be successful and to move forward every single day. Now, some of you and myself included, we struggle to be uncomfortable and of course it's very comfortable to stay in your zone, just chill, relax, and not to be uncomfortable. But that is just a recipe for disaster. Your days, your weeks, your months, your years goes by. And if you're not getting uncomfortable, you're not getting anywhere. So... You need to get out to do things. And these are uncomfortable. Work, grind, think about these things. These are uncomfortable. Work situations are very, very uncomfortable sometimes. Whatever work you might do. Work out, eat healthy, go to the gym, keep that high mental and physical focus uncomfortable push yourself to the limit when you exercise it is uncomfortable eat healthy it is uncomfortable eating salad don't tell me it's comfortable it's not sometimes it is but most of the time I do it because I know it's good for me and it's kind of uncomfortable but I'll try to make it <laughs> as comfortable as possible <laughs> so you have to get uncomfortable. And the better you get familiar with this and accept it for yourself, the better it's going to be. It's never going to be perfect because, again, this is a very, very powerful word. So it's never going to be perfect. It's not easy to walk up to a girl or a guy and ask them out that is not comfortable that is uncomfortable and you might get embarrassed that's even more uncomfortable <laughs> so you're not gonna do it ever again but no you you might get a success out of it but you gotta put yourself in that uncomfortable situation when you push your boundaries, it's uncomfortable. But that will set you up for a successful life. In just about anything, in your business, you got to do things that it's uncomfortable. If you have too many employees and you do the math and mathematically things are bad, you have to let people know. That is let people go. And that is uncomfortable. But you have to make those decisions as a leader. So, the big message here, success in life comes from uncomfortable things that you do every single day in your life. So don't be afraid to be uncomfortable. Don't be afraid to be uncomfortable. And if you master that, you will be successful. You guys, if so far you like my content, please subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, and enjoy. The great Seneca has something to say 
about being uncomfortable. And this is how it goes. No man is more unhappy than he who never faces adversity. For he is permitted to prove himself. So, if you are not facing adversity, you cannot improve your life. You cannot gain experience. You cannot gain wisdom. You have to. You have to face adversity. Now, remember, there are a few things you can do to improve to be uncomfortable. Believe it or not, it comes with a life experience. So, as we get older, we've been through more situations, so we get more comfortable. It, it's like a bubble. You just keep pushing it, getting uncomfortable, and eventually the uncomfortable becomes comfortable and the impossible becomes possible because your bubble is just grow. You're still not 100% comfortable, but now at this point, you can walk up to your girl or a guy and say, hey, I like you. I like to take you out for dinner. And you're okay with it. The other thing you can do, think in a positive way. And something that it's uncomfortable for you, think like, this is new. This is something I haven't done before. This is first time. This is exciting. I'm going to try this. I'm going to see how it goes. So you can rephrase and reset your mind and think positive. Some of you can use humor. Some might not. This is depends on the individual. But humor, it's a really cool thing and it's really fun to kind of smooth out that uncomfortable situation. And just ride through those waves with humor. Now, uncomfortable, it's kind of like the pain in the back. It's there. Longer you push it, put it there, put it there, put it behind you, always put it somewhere, it's just going to be there. It's never going to go away. So you got to do it now. You got to act and do it now. And quicker you get rid of it, quicker it's gone. It's like a dirty laundry. Take it, put it in laundry, wash it, it's gone. Same thing with uncomfortable. Thank you guys for watching. If you like my content, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Enjoy. And more great content coming out. Thank you.